Oh, what's that? Oh, yeah, new merch. Oh, yeah, I've got new, new merch. merch. <laughs> <laughs> Look, we've got this stripped down job. Can this I have scania. my logo on your new merch, though? Uh, yeah, you can do, yeah. With yours? Yeah, with mine, yeah. <laughs> You can have whatever logo you like on it. Look, this is the big job today. Look, look at this. Scania. Full, full strip down of this Scania. Well, Scania bed. There's yes. the bonnet, look. Do you have a bonnet? Oh, Scania one. Oh, someone stuck some stickers on it there, <laughs> It's lovely. Stripping down this bed is going to be a lovely little mission now. Isn't it? Absolutely. Look at that. should come off. Oh. There you go. We've got a charge. There's a plate there. Becky, it's all right. Yeah, but she's one of you. Thank you. Well done. Daddy's here. Thank you, Daddy's here. Hi, Daddy. Just have to wait a bit until Daddy's finished. Yeah, we're fully stripped lot. Wow, well done. We've done it. And any big spiders? No, not really. I'm fine. What's going on? Right, I've done that job, for I'll just strip that bed down, but now Scotty's rang me. He's got to call that. At, uh, at Scottish Yard, something's up with a rammer, something's on one of the machines, and he's desperado for it. So we've had to shoot back home, get some more of your gear, aren't we? Now we're going on a break now, aren't we, my gear? But we're not. Uh, it's one of the days again, isn't it? Let's go! Oh, they're, they're, we're going, they've already gone, look. They fell over, my gear. Nah. Hazards on. Someone had a bit of a boo-boo there, didn't they? Airbags have gone off in the car anyway, so they must have had a fair road here. Front tender. Be as quick as a can here now. Okay, now the right back to that thread, aren't they? Take it, that's to fault. I'm going to see if we've got a bolt, the same thread, and put some slits down it to make a tap. Is that going to tap? Look who's here, guys. Goodwill hunting. What's happened here, Will? Someone's running. Is it Mr. Nobody again? I am. <laughs> I ain't got to thread that, re thread that. What I'm thinking is chop the top bit off. You'd have to it, No, chop this top bit off there because the threads are all right deep down. And then chop some of this off so he doesn't block that pipe up there. So that sits lower. There's fuck all left of them threads. Right, we've bumped that off, but so no metal filings go in it, because that's the last thing we want. I just have to go steady when I just chop it. Don't want to fuck your fire though, do I?
Yeah, I want a, I want another one of these so I can put some slits down it to make myself a tap. But I think we're struggling. Oh, we got any more of these? Yeah, it seems to have gone up all right now. Look, I've had to chop that much off the top of it and then chop that much off the union. You know, so because the pipe, it, it was it was going up to the pipe, the outlet, so I've had to chop that much off the union and all. Uh, we're just gonna go get someone to try it. That little bird is woke because she's had a bicky. Hey, <laughs> booty ball. Look, look at her. Look, she's booty ball. She's a happy little kid, our bird is. You must be the happiest little baby I know, you know. You are. <laughs> I love you. We should be done, my girl. We're just waiting for someone to start it up, basically. And we should be all done. And now I'll go and get you something from that burger shop. What do you reckon? Got something from the burger shop? She's gone, man, gone. Are you gone? Hello? <laughs> yeah, you vickers. Oh. I wonder what that dripping was then, obviously. It's what was in it already. what we like. You can get back to work now. Thank you Bloody good show. <laughs> I do like it when a plan comes together. Yeah, of course it is, mate. Is it working? Hey? Is it working, buddy? One of two ways that could have gone, it could have stripped them threads out and the, I'd have to take the whole rim off and then have that bit replaced all the way it's gone where it luckily went all right and we re-threaded it. And our bird is covering herself in orange juice. <laughs> it's all right, look, it's dripping on you. Come on. <laughs> yeah, I said, say bye-bye. Bye, big digger. Bye-bye. Calm down, dear, it's only roundabout. I don't know whether you saw that or not, but that's the trouble with folk, isn't it? You know, like that bloke in the van there, like, well, like it's just because that lorry pulled off at the roundabout. And obviously lorries can't pull off the same speed as cars, can they, or vans and that. And, you know, they think the driver's doing it on purpose, don't they? When he's not, obviously, it just doesn't accelerate. It's, when he's fully loaded, he can't pull away like a freaking car, can it? Hey, What's the point of just beeping and doing that, mate? Not a cheapo, though, does it? How much time have you lost from that? A few seconds, innit? <laughs> Fucking honest. <laughs> what do you reckon, my princess? Bizarre, aren't they? <laughs> You're on film, you know? Hey? You're on film, are you? Sure. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> I won't pull that in here. <laughs> <laughs> Hey Nick, whenever I'm working, whenever I'm doing that, I'm fucking filming. I've just pulled up here at Partick, and look who's here as well. It's Alex. What's he doing here as well? <laughs> what do you say, Al? Oh, look at that, what's this? Look at that! Slippers on. Fucking hell. Look how dirty it still is. Wow. Shocking, What's the isn't point it? wearing your slippers when you're your stuff, look, anyway? Because I try, I'm trying to keep it clean. You know what? You are, you are doing quite well. It's a struggle. Well, it's a struggle. It's, it's, it's a struggle. It's a struggle. It's like a little meeting place, is Partick, isn't it? You know, like, you don't go to the pub much now. So, obviously, you meet at these parts places, don't you, and have a good old talk. 
I'm going to get some batteries now uh, for Scotty. He's got two lorries that need batteries on it. And it has got the picking station gone down at his yard uh, with, uh, I don't know, he thinks it's diesel. So I've just picked up some, some of these bad boys. And then we'll be going to Scotty's after we get loaded with batteries. Sure, all these batteries, you know, are getting bigger and bigger. Look at the size of that now. Fucking huge, aren't they? Eh? I'll be well loaded up with four of these batteries on, won't I? Whew. Big buggers they are. The other two were the normal size ones. They felt light after them big ones. This safety belt's ever so keen. Come on then, John Smith, let's go. I got me the cloud, look. In fact, she did it wrong again, not upside down this one is so. I'll have it. It's a struggle, life's a struggle, and then you die. Life's just a struggle. Right, off to Scotty's now, let's rock and roll. They were dear. Everything's dear, Chris. Everything's dear. The machine ain't very old, but that fucking radiator looks about bollocks already. It's leaking and that. Thing is, the lads keep topping it up with water, don't they? And it's going to be free it's fucking freezing soon. You can see the red rust coming out there. They need bad freezing it, don't they? Well, I've got to get some filters for that machine. William Wallace has just struck it up and it and it starts up uh, and it only goes for, for about a minute, then it switches itself off and it's coming up with a spanner and an oil sign. But the engine oil's all right, it's topped it up. Uh, they, but you don't, know, you don't know if they've run it lower over here. This is the fucking trouble. You know what I mean? But anyway, I've got to go to workshop now, park at workshop and pick up some filters for it because it looks like it hasn't had a filter change in fuck knows how long. So I'm going to change the oil filter, engine oil, all that for Jazzle, and then just uh, see where we are from there. Look at this what I've got, look. From our Charlie's Diner, look at that. Pork stuffing, taters, gravy, apple sauce, frickin' hell. Trouble is you need a knife and fork really, don't you, and a plate. It's like a proper dinner that is, isn't it? That's like a full on dinner. For £4.70, it's a full on dinner that is, isn't it? Freaking lovely. How do you tackle it with no fucking... You need a knife and fork, don't you? You know what I mean? I'm going to get larped up here, I know. This is going to get messy, isn't it? That's definitely 10 out of 10, that is. Charlie's Diner, Bawtree. Pork, stuff it, blah, everything. everything. Right, I've got to eat the rest of it on the run because I've got to get up. That lorry's got snow on the front. That means we're headed towards snow, people. I do believe I've never been to this Partick Motor Spares before. Hi, I'm the professional struggle, and today I'll be visiting all the Partick Motor Spares depots. I won't really, because there's too many of them. But this is a workshop one. It looks small. Ian, Jack, why is it so small? Have you just gone to minimise? Minimalistic? As long as I've got my filter, guys, I don't care. Size isn't everything, you know. <laughs> oh, look at the snow coming down. I hope there's snow at home, you know, with thick snow. I don't want this, like, shitty shit snow, where it's just like a little dr little blizzard. I want it thick. If it's going to snow, it's best to be thick, isn't it? 
So you can build a snowman. I want birdie to, to build a snowman. They didn't have all the filters I want, but they had the main one, uh, the oil filter. And I got a main fuel filter and all. Uh, it's got another fuel filter on it, but I, it ain't got that, so. But I'm hoping the main fault, I'm hoping it's just not getting much oil pressure through because the filter. That's what I'm hoping. thing was in all the fucking oil and diesel and shit at the bottom of that sump there. That must be the diagnostic thing I thought. It's either that or you plug that in the note to lift the leg. Oh is it? It's got like electric leg up and Oh yeah. Not doing any good though, it's all that fucking shit on there, is it? No, it very well work on What do you want to do? Should we try and start? Just put a fishing on it, Scott, see whether it's got electric pump to it. Is it five-star electric? It must have. Now look, this is what we're waiting for. That's it. I quit my using jet pumps. Right, go ahead, Mitch. Try again then, Mitch. Yeah, hunting, isn't it? I wasn't doing that before, was it hunting? It's like a piston sign. The place who manufactures these in Ireland, the plates on the side. So I'm just going to give them a ring, see if they can shed any light on the situation. Because obviously it's pulling up a fault. It must be going through its motions, pulling up a fault, then shutting the engine down. Uh, whether it'll need diagnostic on it, you'd, you'd have thought so, wouldn't you? But I'll try ringing them, won't I? You can but try, can't you? them lads there that's who this machine's off it's a northern ireland uh, firm i've just been speaking to him uh, a lad there uh, about the faults obviously on this and uh i fucking tell you what ever's helpful you can't get a fucking more helpful person you know compared to this fucking us commercial lot when you ring up a commercial fucking dealer around they don't want to know you do they just oh bring it in mate get towed in mate i don't know mate they know you have to bring it in mate these lot speak to this lad called fenton on there it's been backwards and forwards, we reset it and that cleared all the faults, started it back up again, a different symbol come up. It says, just check your charge coming out of the alternator. I says, well, I put an alternator on this, not long back as I remember. But anyway, so I'm there fucking in, in that control panel, checking the volt. Now, fuck all volts coming from the alternator. So, took the cover off, went to the back there to look at the, uh, to get the power off the alternator at the back. And fuck me, the belt's off. <laughs> There's no belt on it. I rang that Fenton up and says, Mate, you're right, it's not charging. You know why? Because the belt's not even on it. <laughs> uh, yeah, so it's got a belt gun on this, so I'm just going to take all the covers off because you can hardly fucking see inside the thing. It's got that many covers around it. I'm just going to take the covers off, whip the belt off, see if I can get one. Yippee! Happy days! Well done, Fenton! Ha! And it's fucking snowing! <laughs> you can't beat that, can you? Hey, you wee, you. That'll be the reason why Has it got a number? No Yes it has It has a number Woohoo! Let's go back to Partick again Hear me? <laughs> I just like to travel about, don't I? <laughs> Look at this Look at that, isn't that lovely, eh? 
beautiful that is, isn't it? You know, your hands are freezing and that, and snow's it's frick, you can't beat this, can you? And there's them poor office people stuck in an office while well, we're out here, look. Look at this. In the great outdoors. I still haven't fucked up my batteries yet, have I? I can't believe my luck, look. I had this in the van, look, for the forklift. I bought it for the forklift. Our forklift missing one. But look at this lot. I thought on the off chance I'll just try it, see whether it's right. And look at that. Near as damn it is to swearing in it, surely that'll work. One way of finding that, innit? Let's go pull it on. Woohoo! That's a rarity actually having something in it on the van that will do it. Oh. I ain't tried it yet, have I? Let's try it first and then we'll sing its praises. I hope this works, because the plant can't run, you see. The plant, had, there's only half the plant running at the minute. Because without this, you see, there's no plantation running, is there? Let's get in there and have a look at this job. William Wallace! <laughs> I like to become one with the engine, huh? Scotsman and him. It's a nice little cubby hole, isn't it? Yeah, you'd be fucking living that. Well, what have you got? You know what's up with this wheel, don't you? Is it on, mate? The belt's come off. What? The belt's off. Told you, what did I say earlier? Don't talk fucking shit. Yeah, yeah, yeah. No, it's a fucking thing, you're fracking cracker. I said that it doesn't seem like the belt's fucking moving or something like that. Oh, yeah. Did I not? I went to town, I said something to do with the timing belt. You know what it is? Oh, oh, shut the fuck up. You, you talk shit. <laughs> I don't Listen to fucking Will Rennie and you'll go fucking places. I told you. I told you. I fucking told you. Look, boy, just get your fucking out. What do you think you are now? Mechanic now. Fucking. Hey. I'll take you off the job, mate. That's <laughs> YouTube. Hey, oh, Will's a new YouTuber, look. He'll tell you how to go on, don't he? I'll tell you. He reckons he fucking knew about this. Fucking did. Told me about it, my heart. I'll tell you what, everyone knows, don't they, when it when they know what the fault is, then everyone comes an expert. I can't get around in there. Then everyone becomes yeah, an expert, don't they? No, that torch, you can be torch man well instead. Goodwill hunting. Alternator belt. The alternator belt, that's come off, that's what it is. Alright. Yeah. No, it's fucked, but I've got another one on my van, I'm just trying it now. This says it's fucked, but he's put a new one on. Trying to put it on now. We're going to do that one there. Go and get a 13. There's, there's a packet in my passenger side, Will. There's a there's a clear packet with a load of spanners in it and that. It's my 13 mil kit. You got it, William Bonner. I'll take that. Is that what's wrong with it? Cleared all that. That, that fucking hand's a good lad. Easy as Irish. That lad's a good lad. Yeah, he is. He's fucking good. He told me how to clear the faults. So I cleared all the faults, struck it up again, come up with a different fucking symbol. Like lines, three fucking lines. He said, right, I'll get back to you. Is this going to be running? Are you telling me it's going to be running? Well, I've got a belt now. I've just fitting a belt. I luckily had a belt in there. But I'm just seeing if it's the right one because I'm struggling. Yeah, it's fit at the minute. Right, I need a spanner. Well, what's the spanner, mate? You can pick your choice of the fucking dozen walking around here. Is that left-handed spanner or right-handed spanner? <laughs> Yes, Will. We've done it. No, 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 no. Don't count your chickens before they've hatched to the cleggies. And you know what? On, you don't man. have all eggs in one basket, son. You don't. You don't. We know all the eggs same, don't we? We do. We're expert experts. Not fucking that in fancy. Right, that's it. Fucking let's get me out of this fucking place. Is there a sensor there as well, like, and it pips it out? Oh, uh, it's just all got to it because it's not charging, is it? Yeah. See that, everyone? William fixed that, didn't he? Didn't you, Will? Fucking talk shit, don't I? Hey, uh, everyone's an expert, aren't they? An ex is a has-been and a spurt's a drip under pressure. Expert, not expert. Expert. Yeah. I'm just trying to think of something witty to say, but I can't think of it. <laughs> Right. 
the moment of truth. Picking station back on, do take. Well, put these panels on then, William Wallace. Where's your merch stuff? Have you been on my merch shop? No, I've got a merch shop now. Eh? Yeah, are you fucking it's on my channel? Merch. Oh. Oh, I'll tell you what I have got, like, do you want one of these stickers, Scott? Why not? Stick them on the lorry, stick them on the lorry. Right, well, you're going to stick them on the lorry? Yeah, why not? Oh, fuck, I've got loads here. You're going to throw them off? Not because of them. Oh, hey! Yeah, in that pack, what you had? Where's that pack? Hey, we're away with the mixer. We're away with the mixer. Right, we're going for these batteries now at Scotty's place. Other place, not this place, a different place. Because he's got two. What's up with this belt now? Nah, honestly, everything's out to get you, innit? Even belts nowadays, look. What's it doing? Oh, look up there. Oh, honestly. Everything's there to test you, innit? Let's go, people! It that does, it? <laughs> Hello everybody! <laughs> Slow down. The window didn't work. How much is it, mate? 60 bucks, please. Cash or car. You see this here, look, guys. Look at this lot. This is an old chap that's left this behind. Uh, and this is at the top of an ass, and he's, uh, he's passed away, Scott, he? Yeah, the old chap's passed away. But you see all these here, look, this is just left, like, his family's just left it here. But you know if, like, you're a train fanatic? Scott just said that he wouldn't mind it, you know... Reinstating it? Yeah, reinstating it mm. with trains. Because it does seem a shame, doesn't it? Like, down here, look, Scott was just saying, look, down here, look, he's got these here, and they obviously changed the rails, look. With these. I mean, he's took it, uh, he's spent some money and time up here on it, he must have done. Hey? He has, hasn't he? Yeah. Scott was saying, he's even got his own phone line here, lot. Look, look, he must have had his own phone line because he spent that much time up here, lot. <laughs> 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 he was dedicated to this train calls. Isn't it? So, guys, if any of you are interested about trains, lot, we, we, we need this reconditioning. We want trains all round here. Any kind of advice or help? Yeah, any kind of help or advice on the train. If you're into trains, lot, these, these model trains, this is your perfect lot, perfect place to go, this is. Please contact 012121. <laughs> <laughs> so, contact me on the uh, comments if, if you're interested about trains or email me. And... Uh, you can have a go at doing this lot, setting this up as a nice little train stop, isn't it, Scott? Absolutely. But we don't only want trains on here, we want lorries. <laughs> no, we don't really. <laughs> we want lorries as well. <laughs> we, want, we want it all grass and all, and hills, yeah. and we want lights all in it, and it, we want the proper, you know what I mean? What's this? Proper it's job. It's got like ash down here, crap, what's this? It's actually put features Oh, yeah, it. yeah. It's it's from where the I wondered if it was all... I've like done up somehow. He's got some gear. Look, this, he look at this lot. Someone's tried to take the track up. Look, that's the only bit they've tried to take up. I bet they've tried to take it up and thought, whew, not doing this. So they left it up. Yeah, have some fun with your treat. Look, even look, not here, look. Yeah, it goes under, look. Around there. And then down there. Yeah, they're not going far on that one. Look, it's even left this, look, whatever this is, a trans, trans, 
transistorized power control unit. I reckon it's like a sliding zone, like doesn't it? Yeah, it's done that so it looks like proper. Look. And I looked at all these switches and all that. Currently coming in the 945 from Edinburgh. <laughs> <laughs> Fire ash. Please take one, two. Hey, Dan, I'm just switching these rails, Scott. I hope you're not switching my rails, Scott. There. Choo choo. Look at this lot here, look. It's my God. I've noticed some of it because it looks here. This is HS3. This, yeah, this is the next HS3 <laughs> <laughs> in the loft. <laughs> look, this, this look here, look, Scott. This here. That goes to the rails and it's soldered onto the rails there. Yes, the so there's that power of the rails up there. Power so many segments, I don't know. Yeah, it must do. Well, I found a hobby here. Yeah, <laughs> few beers. Scott, a few, yeah, a few beers. My trouble is, we'll get we'll drink more beers before, don't we? I won't be doing many rails. <laughs> and what we'd have to do is get the fastest trains, won't we? <laughs> well, I want my train faster now. See how fast we can get round here. There's steam. Has anyone got any of these freaking trains, guys? Because I want to get this going. Yeah, 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 have you got any we'll of these trains? Them, we'll buy them. Yeah, buy them, lot. buy them. Right, and then we want someone to come and power these rails up, because what we want to do, we'll get, that's what we'll do, Scott. We'll get a few trains in a line, like on a good strip down here, and we'll race them. Well, we can load them with, um, yeah. <laughs> yeah, then we'll have a loading load bay. cans. That's it, they can take your tins around, can't it? What's this? Look, is it, is it even a signing stick? What is it? What's this? Oh, yeah, it's, it's, it's a, a measuring stick, stick lot. Oh, God, look what is that. Oh, that's what. Wow. He spent some time, you know. I bet that's where he pour his trains, you know, isn't it? Up here. Isn't that a shame, lot? So, now in the time, the old lad. Yeah, don't I don't know his name, but... Don't worry, John. mister. John. Oh, John. I know you're gone, John, but your trains will live on through Scotty. <laughs> actually, do you know the will, actually? The will, you see, there. So we're going to get some trains on here and we have some races. Do any of you train fanatic guys? Horn is it Hornby? It used to be Hornby, I don't know. Hornby does ring a bell, yeah. Look, we've got a little stopper there for when we reach ultra speed. Yeah. You know, that's the, this is the loading line. He, used to, he obviously had something here. He did, he must Under, have had something special there. Absolutely, because that's where he stopped. He's back, he's training. And he's loaded it, hasn't he? He lived in his own world, being honest. He did, didn't he? He lived in his own world. We're missing some tra track as well, so we need some track. But yeah. Tracks and trains we'll buy. Tracks, trains we need. And we need someone with the knowledge to power it up, Scott, don't we? Yeah, there's a small issue of knowledge. <laughs> there's a small issue of knowledge what we haven't got. I reckon just power it up to 240 volt, they'll go around like hell, won't they? <laughs> 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 they're 240 on these trains. Right, but you have to have a warning sticker for the kids, obviously, not to touch the rails. <laughs> Absolutely. <laughs> yeah, Scott was just saying, this chap who owned this, this John, he actually worked on the railways. So obviously he took his he took his work home with him as such, we'll, didn't he? We'll, we'll, we'll take the we'll take the name off the letter downstairs, Chris, because that'll be his name. Oh yeah. Might, somebody might know him might be in the in the in the world of transport and trains. Yeah. Look at that old cooker and all that. The old kitchen. Is it normal to have an an XT on the drive? No. <laughs> <laughs> Is this normal? Well, I've got to change these batteries. You know, I've been waiting till it's dark to change them. Because <laughs> I like to make everything a struggle. Right, now we've fixed the rail job and the lights. Can we do these batteries on this fucking lorry? <laughs> I've only been doing these batteries since this morning. This morning I come down to these batteries. <laughs> fucking all six, what is it? All six at night now. This one's done, did we've just got another one to do. But the other one is just a normal one where it's at the side, so it's not all that mission of taking that cross member off, he says. <laughs> Fucking heavy, yes. There's the next one. A simple one. Who's that? The Marty Moe? Marty Moe, yeah. He hasn't moved back. <laughs> 
That job went okay anyway. I only noticed my phone went over when I'd finished the job, so I don't know how long it was over for, I'm sure. But I'm done now anyway. So I'm going home. Bloody late. Right. I'll see you in a bit, guys. Have a good week, guys. Woo-hoo!